Our camera's on one man. He's been in terrific form as evidenced by four goals in three games. Stay with us. Hello, great to be with you. We're here in Stratford at the London Stadium, a ground built originally for the Olympics in 2012. I'm Derek Ray, positioned here on the commentary gantry, and alongside me at the microphone is Stuart Robson. And don't be frightened by the fact that it's Halloween. We're hoping that there's a real treat in store for everyone today. It's West Ham United versus Manchester United. Well, I was told my treat was having a day off. But actually, I'm pleased to be here because this should be a really good game. Davies. Rashford unable to hold it. This is the team Manchester United will go with. Well, it's a 4-5-1, but with three of the midfield players giving close support to the centre forward and the other two sitting deeper. Also watch out for the fullbacks getting forward at every opportunity. They do like to get crosses into the box. Kamavinga. It should be! And a very good challenge. Well, who will be the player to decide the outcome, to determine the course of events? No reason at all why it won't oh, be. Oh, Derek, big moment here. A smart stop here. He's driven in the corner. Oh, a very fine header, but it wouldn't go in for him. Well, United have started the game really well here. And that was a big chance to open the scoring. Great save, though. And looking to apply further pressure from this position. Well, sitting deep like this might be a dangerous game. Well, nothing productive, really. Well, possibilities in the centre. And he's kept it out, fully stretched, somehow reaching it. And he's fired over the corner. Well, nothing wrong with the header, but it was always going that little bit off target. Lisandro Martinez. Maguire. Juan Bisaka. Passing it around, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Can he put them in front? Well, it did look promising, but no threat in the end. Coleman. Good run, very much in control of the situation. Coleman. Oh, commanding goalkeeping. And the referee retrospectively will go back and hand out the yellow card. Playing it in. Oh, good save. Excellent header. Well, another corner kick conceded. Let's see what they do this time. They favoured a short one here. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Well, another corner, hot on the heels of the last one. No trouble at all as far as the keeper was concerned. Needed to be more accurate from the keeper. Coman. Can they nudge in front? And there is the goal that gives them a well-merited lead. It had been coming. Well, as the replay shows, this is all about his ability to find space in the box, which then makes the finish look so much easier. That's good play from him. <laughs> 
So United restart the game. Disappointed to have conceded. Can they come up with an equaliser? Mount. On to Juan Bissaka. Lisandro Martinez. And the ball with Alfonso Davies. And he stopped them in their tracks. Amin Guiri. Kudus. This attack looks highly promising. And well, that's how to do it inside your own penalty area. So approaching half-time with United behind, albeit narrowly. Stuart, what have you made of their performance in the first 45? Well, I've been a little disappointed with their attacking play. It's all been a bit too slow. If they can pass it into their front areas with more quality, switch play quicker and be more positive in 1v1 situations, I think they'll get back into this. Mount. It's with Martinez. Showing patience, looking for the equaliser. Rashford. And quick thinking defensively. And there it is, the half-time whistle. That will do it for the first half here at the London Stadium. Back underway then, and work to do for United, given the scoreline. Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. Coman. Teammates available. And that's really well read. Well, it wouldn't stay in play for them. Goal kick. Well, they are committed to making the substitution here. Maguire. On to Juan Bissaka. And a friendly reminder that we have more action from the Premier League coming up. It's West Ham United facing Wolverhampton Wanderers. Lisandro Martinez. Well, this looks really productive. What can they do from this position? Opportunity to level it. And the attack fades out. Kudus. Amin Guiri. doing everything in their power to make sure they're not pegged back well as you can see he's so alive to the rebound he's first to react and then he gets his reward it's a good goal here and the ball is moving again well we have 30 minutes to go Edson Alvarez well he's certainly not alone And defending as a unit. Oh, might be. Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. I'm hearing someone has scored in the Leicester game. Alex Scott has the news. Yep, another goal for Leicester City. It's all level again at 2 2 with 65 minutes played. Cheers, Alex. Oh, 
big opportunity. Really good piece of goalkeeping there. Don't forget about the fourth round of the Carabao Cup live coverage here on EA TV. It's Manchester United facing Spurs. Well, we're down to the last 16 now, so plenty to play for in that game in what will be a tough encounter. Coman. And beating the defender. Must score! Well, we're inside the final 15 minutes. Here's Juan Bissaka. Bruno Fernandes. Well, the angle was acute, but not working the goalkeeper at all. Well, wrong decision, I would say. He was never going to score from there. And a substitution in the offing. An effective challenge. Mohamed Kudus. Lucas Ocampos. Oh my goodness, you've really got to praise the defending. That was top notch. Well, the minutes are ticking away, and United have cause to think that they can play an awful lot better than this. Well, there's been a real lack of energy right from the start of the game, certainly when they haven't had the ball. They're closing down, decision-making and recovery runs just haven't been good enough. Juan Bissaka. Will he play it in? High-quality defending. And showing fine vision. Well, here's the replay. He's done really well to get his head up and pick somebody out with that cutback. And he makes the finish look so easy. What a good goal that is. Is this going to be a thrashing? 3-0 now. So two minutes of stoppage time here. Here's Juan Bissaka. Anthony. On to Juan Bissaka. Fernandes. Veering in field here. Looking for a teammate. Closing down well. And so there it is, the final whistle. And Manchester United have lost this game, much to the disappointment of their supporters. Well, we talked about it before the game. They just can't defend. Today, they were slow to press the ball. They were beaten too easily in the 1v1 situations and they didn't defend their box. That's a worrying performance for me.